Hello, this video will cover how to access who is in your group and who the team leader is. Um, it will also show you how to do your um, collaboration file if you're showing a shared file in presentations. So from the main dashboard, you're going to go ahead and click on the course. Once you click on the course, you're going to look for people on the left hand side from the menu bar. Select people. Once you select people, you're going to go to the group tab, click on that. So now I'm on the group tab. It'll show all the available groups for the entire course. Um, everyone should be in two groups. You'll know, know which group you're in by looking at the word visit. It should be next to the team that you're in. So I'm actually in, as Happy Gilmore, I'm in two different groups, um, team zero and ethics team zero. So what you're going to do is you'll notice that if you have the word manage next to your visit, that also means that you are the team leader. So what um, I'd like you to do is go ahead and click on that little drop down triangle box and it'll let you see who all is in your group. And then the little hat next to um, the little icon next to whoever, whoever's name, that would be the leader of the group. So Happy Gilmore is the leader of this group. And then you should see the other um, team members that are in the team. And what you'll need to do is if you want to see what's inside of the team or the group, you go ahead and click on the visit and it'll have the options. The way you know that you are in your team's page, um, it should have the name of the team right after the name of the course. And then from here, you should be able to communicate. Um, again, you can see your people and you can actually click on um, names or if you want to contact me, the instructor, just click on my name. And it should allow you to, um, oh, well, not allow you to contact. It actually allows you to see my detailed um, web page. So from here, um, you have files, you have discussions, you can set up conferences, collaborations, um, announcements, or home, um, the home page for, for, this, for this team. All of these items are available for you. Um, what I'd like you to do is go to collaborations. If you'd like to work on a, a file together, what you can do is click on collaborations and here um, start a new collaboration. Now again, you're only going to do this one time. So one person from the team would do this. Um, it could be the team leader or someone else. Keep in mind the team leader is responsible for posting the group link once the project is done for the class to see in the class discussion. So you'll notice here you have two options, Google Apps or Office 365. I'm going to select Google Apps. Once I do that, I'm going to scroll down and then the kind of Google app, um, you want to um, click on the carrot, the drop down carrot, and I want to create a presentation to share with um, everyone. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. So that will be a collaboration between my groups. And where it says name, I'll go ahead and put in ethics project and then from here I've given it a name and then I'll go and click on the names of the people in my group or as an alternative you can go to groups and um, you should be able to still see the people that are all in your group and then if you have multiple people make sure you put all those people there and then once that's done you're going to click on the submit button and then once you've done that now you'll have the actual file presentations um, you'll authorize that under your Google login and then you will be able to work um, simultaneously on the same file and that's it and if you like to edit or delete it you can do that here and it says who the person was that it was started by and it has the name of the project and you can actually do multiple um, collaborations here so that's it for this video and remember today is a great day to learn accounting and don't forget your due dates noted in Canvas for this project.